ఐ వాంట్ టు టెల్ ఆల్ ఆఫ్ యూ వన్ థింగ్ వీ ఆర్ వెరీ హ్యాపీ టు హ్యావ్ దిస్ సబ్మిట్ దిస్ విల్ బి ఏ గేమ్ చేంజర్ ఇన్ ఫ్యూచర్ హౌ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఐ వాంట్ టు ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్ వన్ థింగ్ టుడే Andhra Pradesh has always been at the forefront of adopting cutting edge technologies to address modern challenges. Today we have advanced drones, CCTV cameras, mobile phones, apps, satellite data, wearables, multi- multiple other IoT devices. these devices are recording and analyzing information on a run time basis i spoke about it at the time then everybody at the time they used to do only job work i used to talk about not only doing job work you have to go for products then some people have gone to certain action for products then i used to talk don't be a job seeker be job provider that is where i promoted entrepreneurs today i am proud to say indians are getting highest per capita income anywhere in the world among indians 30% are telugu community i am proud to promote this it is only in one idea it is only 25 years money is not the constraint as ram mohan naidu has rightly mentioned at that time hyderabad wherever i go people used to ask me how to come to hyderabad even sometimes they asked me which hyderabad there is one hyderabad in pakistan also they used to ask me which hyderabad i used to say hyderabad in india then they used to ask me how to come come to delhi or bombay overnight you stay there morning you come complete the business go to bombay again midnight you have to catch the flight then they used to ask me why should we come to your state we can do business in bombay that is more convenient for us then i tried for open sky policy at that time there are no flights at least ram mohan naidu is very happy now so many flights and secretary also so happy then i asked the then prime minister open sky policy first flight from emirates has come to hyderabad i built traffic first then i want to go for airports we don't have money airport authority are not willing to spend money what to do then i created a concept that is green field airport i acquired 5000 acres for that airport i convinced the then prime minister rajpai ji to go for green field airport now all airports one by one so many private private airports are coming i am very happy now civil aviation department is very progressive and also very positive to create one airport green field because of policy matter i had 32 meetings with the prime minister and civil aviation department that is how it has happened after that outer ring road biotechnology park it bt pharma you name anything everything we brought to hyderabad today i am very proud to say hyderabad the best city in india for better living standards all these things only two and a half decades today i am telling you we are having a very dynamic prime minister narendra modi ji he brought india globally proud 
he promoted indian brand throughout the world now he is working towards third largest economy in the world another 2 3 years time now he is working for vikasit bharat 2047 if all of us is work together i am confident india will be number 1 or 2 indians will be number 1 globally that is going to happen i am 100% confident about it if all these things has to happen we have to work differently here if you see data is wealth we have a huge amount of historical data already available and every day 400 million terabyte of such data is being generated ai and ml based analytics on this data is changing the way we see our world here if you see telecom regulation deregulation has come digital currency has come that also i am very happy i am fortunate honorable prime minister narendra modi asked me to give a report on digital currency now in the world highest circulations on digital currency is in india we are very proud we are having aadhar authentication that is one advantage we are having gst even narendra modi ji has promoted jam jandan aadhar mobile sing this is another biggest advantage we are having now aishman bharat arha for education portal even for certificates lockers all these things are coming here i wanted to tell all of you in future data is wealth how much money you are having is not the question how much data you are having that will be biggest wealth for an individual for a company or for the country if you are having data you can go through artificial intelligence and also machine learning for proper outcomes that will be the game changer in future even now here we are all in a inspiring time i repeatedly am requesting all young brains and academicians you have to think differently one is in cloud data is available through uberization artificial intelligence you can use it by getting proper knowledge now drones have come we can program it we can send it to anywhere get information